Well, you might want to cover your nose for this story, right? These are... <laughs> There are rather high levels of pollen across East Texas, and spring is just getting started. If you haven't dealt with the sneezes and itchy eyes, then you must be one of the lucky ones. Tristan Hardy has some of the best ways you can take care of yourself this allergy season. Don't be fooled by nature's looks. The spring season is when everything starts to bloom, but it brings along baggage, like pollen. And the climate um, and weather patterns here are such that Pollen is, is probably more prolific than it is in other areas of the country. Usually around this time, allergists in Tyler, like Dr. Jonathan Buttram, say they don't get a break. They'll have allergic rhinitis, nasal inflammation, where they have itching, sneezing, congestion, and runny nose. He says those cold snaps we've had this year play a huge role in how much pollen there is now. That's because trees and plants are trying to catch up with the current season. Right now, Dr. Butram says this is the peak of allergy season, and he suggests the best way not getting caught up in it is to stay inside. The more practical solutions are avoid going out in the early mornings. Early to mid-morning is probably when pollen is at its peak. Dr. Butram says you'll want to protect your face as much as you can. Wear glasses when you go out. Drive with your windows up and close the windows to your home. Allergy medicine over the counter can get pricey, depending on what you want. Dr. Buttram says nasal sprays can help, but there's a catch. That you have to use them daily, but they will take about three to five days to start working. They take about two to three weeks to reach the max of what they're going to do. Another helpful tip to dealing with your allergies, Dr. Buttram says you should shower in the evenings when you come home. You don't want the pollen sitting on your skin and bed sheets overnight. Tristan Hardy, CBS 19. Dr. Buttram says today is the second highest tree pollen count in the last five years.